First thing we're gonna do is drain the oil out of this. So if you haven't done this, you just need to elevate your pump above whatever you're going into, preferably a harvest right filter. You're gonna twist this little knob to the left and then oil will start to flow. Eventually you're gonna to wanna to tilt this to the front so it gets all of the oil out. Less oil in here is gonna make less mess. While our oil is draining, I'm gonna go ahead and pull off the demister. This just turns counterclockwise. It's threaded onto this housing. This might also be a good time to change your demister if it's not functioning properly anymore. You can pick up a new one at freezedryingsupplies.com. Now that the demister is removed, you can take a funnel, place it in the top. Make sure your oil valve is turned all the way to the right and closed. Add just under one quart of your favorite vacuum pump oil. I prefer Robin Air. Fill your pump with oil until you meet the halfway point on the sight glass on the front. Screw the demister back on and you're ready to freeze dry. For freeze drying supplies and accessories, make sure you check out freezedryingsupplies.com. Hey, you, are you unlocking your full potential as a freeze dryer? You're missing out on pro freeze drying tips and freeze dryer giveaways, valuable food storage recipes, and most important, unlocking your inner freeze drying guru. Click the first link in the description to get signed up.